Hi everybody and welcome to the SkyRadar launch. Today I show you a comparison of raw data and uh, moving data filtered out by a moving target indicator. Right side is the moving data with the MTI filter, left side is just raw data. You see our radar is rotating, I have a corner reflector and you see my movements on the right side very nicely filtered out. On the left side it's not recognizable. So this filter is important. I put now the corner reflector away. You see how nicely the radar is tracking me. I move now and you know, first I stand still. It doesn't see me. But once I start moving, you see now my movements appear. <laughs> we are in a small, in our small lounge room here, which is uh, of course not built for presentations and so on. But you see, we set the range down to four meters, and there is no problem with the reflections of the wall. It works perfectly. Um, so even for uh, small environments, it's wonderful. But it shows you also how nicely you can filter out moving data in um, a very challenging environments and this is what you normally have you know when you have for instance a runway with many buildings around that are disturbing you just want to want to have the moving persons the cars or the aircrafts uh, um, tracked so you see my movement here i'm moving and it takes me from uh, absolute close range one meter to we can do it nicely until with that training radar until 25 meters so I hope that you like our little presentation. In the next video, we show you how you can do even more with the moving target detection, which uses the Doppler frequency as well. Stay tuned. See us at skyradar.com. Thanks, folks. See you soon.